So for Siri to tell us more about the paintings, we will need two things. First, well, we will need Siri, so it's going to be a speech synthesizer. And we need some content as well to read. So first, I'm going to import AV Foundation. So import AV Foundation. And here I'm going to call var series. So that's going to be created as an AV speech synthesizer. And also here I'm going to paste the content for my paintings. So I've got content for, and this is a dictionary with string and very long string. Uh, so I, every time we recognize Water Lily Pond and that we get this as we printed it here. So instead of printing, we're going to ask Siri to read all of this for us. Okay, so what we will need to do this is to create a new function. So I'm going to have a function here that's going to be called say what and that's going to be a string. Okay, so in here we need to create what we call a speech uh, utterance. So let's call, uh, let's create this. So it's going to be my utterance equals, which is basically what what you want uh, to say. So uh, it could be content, I guess. So let content equals that's an AV speech uh, utterance. And then you will have the string that you want to pass. And that string obviously is going to be uh, what? So description. And that's going to be our description. Okay. And then very simply, we just ask Siri to speak and we are going to call our content in here. Cool. So now that we have this very handy little um, function, let's call it here. So uh, depending on what we have as an image name, so let's just say what, and here the string is going to be the content for, and in here I'm going to pass my image dot name. Now you may um, you may recognize something before that Siri has. Um, so I'm going I'm going to unsafely unwrap this for now. By the way, uh, I know I'm absolutely sure about my strings and my names, but you should obviously do. Uh, some guard etc if you want to what's going on wow okay double <laughs> right I guess I should know I should do some guard so guard let's image name equals image name else return okay so that's going to be my image name and okay so then let we can guard as well so mm, here I'm going to say just let content equals content for image name okay and here I just have to call my content and that should be safe So yes, I was saying before Xcode interrupted me that Siri might want to start speaking before it stopped uh, to read. You know, it might be only here halfway through and you just recognize surprised. In order to make sure that we don't have any uh, problem with this, we can simply call Siri and just tell him to shut up. Stop speaking at, and here you can say immediate or after uh, the last word, the end of the word, for example. Let's just see what they have. Dot 
yeah, it's only those two basically, so immediate or world. I'm just going to use immediate, so as soon as this image name is recognized, uh, we make sure that we get the image name and the content for that image, and we get Siri to tell uh, this content. And first of all, this function is going to make sure that Siri stops speaking and then starts here. All right, enough talking. Let's now run the app and see how it works. Surprised by Henry Rousseau, this jungle scene was painted by the French artist Henry Rousseau, Water Lily Pond by Claude Monet. In 1883, Monet moved to Giverny where he lived until his death. There, on the grounds of his property, he created a water garden for the purpose of cultivating aquatic plants, over which he built an arched bridge in the Japanese style. In 18... Right. Okay. I think that's enough. <laughs> Once the garden had matured, the painter undertook 17 views of the motif under... And that's basically it. So I hope that was useful. Uh, I'm sure there is a lot you can do with this. Definitely, but in this section I wanted to show you that AR is not just about visuals. Sometimes you really just want to keep your eyes on the reality and observe uh, the beautiful painting you would have in front of you in a museum. But also at the same time you use a different um, sense basically and you use uh, voice to tell the user a little bit more about what's around them right now.